Hi everyone, today I'm going to talk about the power of the Force 2, Muff Tack and Cabe. Real quick disclaimer before the video starts. I have a um, splint on because I broke my wrist. And also, ignore the garbage truck in the background. Um, so let's start this video off with the smaller figure. Um, this is Cabe. She, well, they were both in the most Isley Cantina in A New Hope, uh, the time when Luke and Obi-Wan went into the cantina to look for a pilot. Um, she's got this little, like, it's a really unique weapon. It's like this axe type thing. It's, it's a really cool weapon. Um, she's got her nice uh dress here and in the movie you could see her for like just a couple seconds but she was like reaching for a drink she's like this rat type creature called the chadra fan i really like the way she looks she's got her little feet there but she can actually move her waist Um, but yeah, I think it's a really great figure. It's got a lot of detail on the dress there. And it's also, like, the vest is really nice. Actually, I think, yeah, you could take the vest off if you're someone who would do that to a figure. Like, it's very, it would be very difficult and very hard to get back on. So, definitely not something I'm going to be doing. It's also not supposed... The vest is not supposed to come off. Um, and then we've got Muff Tack here, who is a Talls. Um, he's a really cool figure. He was sitting at a table with a few other guys... And honestly, he was probably, when I first watched the movie, he was probably one of my favorite characters, even in A New Hope. Uh, I love the cantina scene. He's got this weird, like this big weird gun. It's pretty weird looking. Imagine, okay, imagine if Cabe was holding that gun. It's huge right there in Cabe's head. Yeah, but these figures came in a two-pack together because Muff Tack and Cabe, actually behind the scenes, are good friends. Um, so I think that's why they put them together in the two-pack, even though they weren't seen together in the movie. Muff Tack, Muff Tack's a Talls, like I said. And I love the tall species. You can see his head moves. They've got like four eyes and this cool mouth thing. It's really cool. Also, there's like a line there, but that's like, I think the head was like two pieces when they were uh, making it originally, and then they like glued them together. It's pretty neat. He's got these big feet too, which are cool. If I kind of, now you can't see his head. All right, but he's got these big feet. Um, I think they're cool. They're like these, I don't know. They're just like big feet with claws. Uh, you do not, however, want to make him sit down. <laughs> kind of looks a bit cursed. Ah! And then I really like the detail with his thick coat of fur. Um, his other arm has actually another point of articulation there. So he can like, I don't know, pat his belly if you wanted him to. <laughs> or actually, can he hold Cabe? Wait. He, oh my gosh, he can carry Cabe. Oh my gosh. Muff Tack carrying Cabe. 
<laughs> well, that was the video. If you have enjoyed, leave a like and check out some of my other videos. They're all Star Wars uh, figure reviews or Marvel figure reviews, Motu, Funko, and I have a lot more videos. So stay tuned and I'll see you guys in the next one.